Okay, we are live, live from the level. <laughs> um, I will sort out the light because now it's pitch black, but I do have some light here actually. Uh, hold on, that's better. Okay. <clears throat> so what I'm trying to do now is to put this Put this camera somewhere where it makes sense. Okay. <clears throat> um, you'll have to forgive me because this is this is live from the lobo again. Can you believe it? Okay. <clears throat> and um, what I'll do is. I'll do like this, okay? And behind me, I have a dog who is getting very, very warm. So, I'll do like this. Hold on. Can I see his little... This little pause. Okay. I'll, uh, he's under the sleeping bag. <clears throat> okay. Okay, that's better. Now. Okay, so uh, here's the situation. I am um, I am in my level again, and I am doing an overnighter. Um, I took the canoe, I paddled out here, and um, I have my dogs here. So it's very similar to um, to last yeah a few days ago actually. So. Um, I thought I would try to do a, um, a live stream again uh, because last time uh, was a success, you know. Um, you guys seem to enjoy that. And um, yeah, now a uh, question popped up there in the live stream in the chat. Sorry, um, if it's cold. Um, actually, it's not that cold. And Look at this. <clears throat> I have I have a campfire. So um, what I will do is <clears throat> uh, I should prepare a little bit better for you know this. Uh, so hold on. Yeah, that should sort it out um okay do you want to look at my tired old face or the campfire <laughs> uh maybe the sound isn't so great when i sit behind the camera uh thank you for the donation there um that was a wonderful donation from logos research associates two questions first norway um yeah, no we we look at is each other as as you know the same uh, the same people in a way you know we are nordics if you will um yeah the second question i i will it's a little bit difficult because of because of youtube some some topics they don't don't want us to talk about those anymore uh berserker gang uh has been a member for four months wonderful and check out berserker gang 2019 wonderful channel um yeah so i'm out here and um i thought 
last time I thought this was the last of a night to with the dogs um, before you know before it gets warmer again in, in springtime. But then we had some warm days and uh, Berserker Gang. Well, that's awesome. Thanks a lot. Um, <laughs> hot topics. Yes, we're not supposed to talk about the hot topics. Um, yeah, we had some warm days, and then I thought, okay, I'll, um, I'll, um, I'll take the dogs out for another overnighter, and if it gets cold, uh, because of the breed of dog they are, they don't have much fur at all, and they get cold, you know, and so it might be the last overnighter with the dogs, um, before winter, well, before spring. Uh, so here we are, and I got here quite late. I got here quite late. So I don't like that, because then I, it's, I, I have to stress about everything, you know, pitching the lobo and, and um, yeah, it's, it, it, it is dark, it is dark, it's not a studio. <laughs> um, what bands did you grow up listening to? Uh, and thank you for the donation. Uh, let's see. Uh, different music. Um, some metal music, I would say. Uh, because, uh, and also, you know, in at parties. You know, I'm, I'm so old, so... Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> you know, heavy metal in the 80s. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Yeah, it's um, yeah. I can remember that. That was, that that kind of music w was often played at at parties and so on. But um, yeah, um, so here I am. I thought I would uh, grab the chance and sneak away, and uh, yeah, I got here quite late. It is the same island. I'm so boring, you know. It's the same island. It's the same campfire. Um, I have, you know, the same stone circle. I actually pitched the lava around the same stone circle. Uh, not not an ancient stone circle. I made this, you know, this this uh, stone circle last time I was here, and I thought. Since I'm late, I will just go there and I will, um, yeah, I, uh, I'm at the same exact location. The only difference is that I have turned the level uh, 90 degrees uh, because of the wind direction. But not, right now, there is no wind at all. So, yeah. <clears throat> um, now... So um, yeah, I'm trying to film a video as well. I'll do my best. It's it is difficult. Uh, those of you who have a YouTube channel will know what I'm talking about. Uh, especially when you, you're doing something, you're supposed to do something, and if I don't do the things <laughs> here out there, uh, I will get cold because it's it is getting cold, you know. Um, and um, and you have to do that while you're filming, so it's not always so uh, easy. Um, and I have to right now keep one eye at the fire as well. Um, I have the dogs behind me, um, and um, again, you know, safety reasons. Um, Obviously, they I couldn't have an open fire in the lobo if they were walking around in here, but they are not. They are not. Um, yeah. So I was. I'm. You know. Spoiler alert. I'm going to make probably two videos um, from this uh, trip. Um, one video for the main channel. This channel. <clears throat> And one video oh, for Bjorn Outdoors. <clears throat> and 
I am. I, I just recorded actually a monologue. <laughs> Sounded very uh, artistic. Uh, a monologue um, where I said that, and this is kind of a spoiler, you know, that it's it's time to move on, you know. And I talked about that. It's time to move on. Um, and my, and I I can add this big something that I didn't say my. Or I think I didn't say that. Um, I think we've gotten a little bit uh, obsessed with, uh, and, uh, you know, it's quite natural that we're obsessed with the craziness that's been going on, you know. But uh, by now, it's like, I. one thing is we're not supposed to talk about it and they will remove your channel. If you do. Another thing is that we, by now, we we know what we know. I can say that. A uh, gray man prepping is here. Um, have you gotten to ten thousand subscribers yet? Yet, uh, if not, uh, go well in. You know, anyway, go and 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 subscribe to gray man prepping. Um, yeah, so, so what I'm trying to say is that, you know, we should move on, you know, we we need to move on. Now I need to tend to the campfire. Look at this. So, what can we do here? Ah, it's so warm. Mm-hmm. I'll uh I'll put this one here. Yeah, I'll just put it like so. I'll try that. I'll try that. <clears throat> I'm heating it up to avoid the smoke, and then we'll put it in the fire. Okay. <clears throat> so, uh, homestead, aus, 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 from for Australia. Yeah, what can I say, you know, um, again, um, Australia, why? Some people say, well, it's because they gave up their guns. Well, wh why isn't the same happening in all the countries that where people gave up their guns? That's my, that's, that's my question, you know, um, I, I, it's it's a it's sort of it's, it's I feel for you guys down there. I really do. I really do. But anyway, um yeah, you know, I've said the many times that out here, you know, here here is where this is the real world. Um living in a city, well lots of people live in a city. It's it's not I'm not trying to criticize people for living in a city but um it's not the real world you know it is not the real world this is the real world um and you lose touch with i think with what really matters when you're caught up in conflicts and you're being fed conflicts by social media by uh, by the news on TV, you know, the talking heads on TV. Uh, it's, it, it is not healthy, you know. And this is, this is the real world. And I think people need to snap out of it. People need to uh, get back to what's true and real. Um, 
the, the level of conflict is not healthy. That That's what I think, you know. Uh, that's what I think. And, and this, this goes for all of us, I guess. Uh, it's part of human nature to get caught up in the conflicts and and to, to you know, so, so I'm talking to myself as well here, I guess. And it's not so easy for everyone to get out in nature and connect with nature. Some people live in places where that is quite difficult. Um, but you should still try, you know. You will find all the answers out here. Um, if I can see the moon, yes. Uh, well, I could. Now it's it's moved. Yeah, now I can see it. Yeah. Um, and you know what? Another thing <clears throat> is that when you connect with the real world, that's the world out there in nature, you know. When you do that, you realize that many of those conflicts are not that important, you know. Don't get me wrong here. Um, it's I know it's easy for me to say, you know, I live in Norway and the restrictions were lifted and so on, and I didn't really bother about them. You know, I didn't really... <laughs> anyway, but... Um, um, still, you know, I'm... Um, I'm a little bit incoherent here. Uh, I hope that's the right word. But I'm trying to say that don't get caught up in those conflicts, you know. By now you will by now you should know what is right, what is true, what is right. Um and you should act um thereupon. Um yeah, that, that's what I think, you know, that's what I think. Um, okay, uh, it's, uh, that's, a, that's a, if I could put a beer in a headlock, if, I, <laughs> why would I do that? Uh, <laughs> so, um, Yeah, I a bit of funny, funny uh, guy yeah, jokes. Some jokes here. Okay. Um, I. <laughs> well, why would I put a bear in a headlock? Is it like? Is it a joke? Like because my name means my name is means Bjorn, bear actually Bjorn, that's uh, bear. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, that's it's it's a common Norwegian name, you know. Um, uh, yes, when we connect with nature, we connect with ourselves exactly, exactly. Uh, what do you do for Christmas? Well, we call it Yule, uh, which I uh, well. Um, Ladislav Pumesny, uh, welcome as a member to the channel and thank you very much. Um, for Yule, um, I like that we call it Yule because it's you know the old heathen uh name, uh, but um, yeah, well, you know, we have dinner, you know, and gifts, and uh, it's very much the same. As in in the UK and uh, uh, North America, I believe. Uh, but we open the gifts on Christmas Eve, actually. Yeah. Uh, so.
Yeah, we 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 say jul. <clears throat> okay. Uh, Jonna, uh, good to see you here. Good to see you. And Nether Warmington, thank you for the donation. Uh, Chuck Norris. <laughs> Uh, Chuck Norris is 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 very cool, um, and I like all the all the jokes, um, uh, the Chuck Norris jokes. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, I am a little bit disappointed because I'll tell you, I'll tell you this: I can hear the cars from where I am now. Um, we were here a few times during the summer and uh, we didn't hear anything but that's because you only drive on this the road there at the other side of the lake if you're going to sweden and they opened the um, the borders recently so it's quite a lot of traffic now it's friday night so is it friday night yeah, it is Friday night. Um, yeah, so so lots of people are going there to to I don't know party. I don't know. So that's that's a little bit disappointing that I can hear the cars. Um, yeah. Next time I will uh, travel further in. It's it's a huge system here of of lakes and uh, so on, so you can travel further. Um, and I I really don't want to hear the cars, you know, but I can hear the cars. Um. So. Uh, Misa says, Misa is writing here, I live in Denmark, it's impossible to not hear cars anywhere, unless you are at an, on a, on at North Sea or something. Yeah, uh, Denmark is a lot more densely populated. Okay. Just checking uh, how the how Elvis is doing. He's uh, sleeping behind me. <clears throat> and Feline is sleeping at yeah. Did you hear that? Okay. Uh, I'm going to try to sort out, not now, but sort out a, a better light because I'm holding the GoPro with, an, with a light attached to it, which is not ideal. Um, what do you think about wind power and the destruction of nature? Well, I don't support that. I am very much against that. So, uh, the white rabbit says, we live far up in the mountains, no car sounds. Uh, I have been to the UK many times. I have. Um, and Iceland. If you, um, I've been to Iceland, I think. No, I've been to Iceland only once. Or was it twice? It's some time ago now. <clears throat> um, now let's see, I'm trying to keep an eye on the chat and also on the ghosts outside of the level. <laughs> uh, do you believe, yeah, the werewolves. There are werewolves on the island. Um, 
Yeah, I'm not Scott. I'm not going to. I'm not going to address it because what we see now is that channels are being removed. Uh, if only for mentioning this, they are being removed. Um, I'm not going to. You know, it's. It's. Yeah, there's a lot to be said about that. You know. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, uh, the bow and arrow attack. I did a live stream. Uh, I commented on that on my on my one of my other channels, uh, Bjorn Talks, which you should subscribe to, by the way. Uh, there's a link in the video description. Um, and we know more now. It seems like, well, we know that this guy, he he was a, he converted to Islam and he probably had had, had mental issues for a while. Uh, and he went into people's homes, like random people. As far as I can understand, and, um, and, and killed people, you know, in their homes. So it's really, really horrible. Uh, what they said in the news, you know, I don't believe every, everything in the news. I had some trolls saying that, well, it's it was a, uh, uh, it's the it's the government, you know. And I, I have to I have a comment to people like that. You know, it's not like not everything is a conspiracy. Not everything. Uh, sometimes it's very simple. Bad people go out and do bad things. So yeah. Yeah. Um really horrible and um it seems like what he did was one of the methods um that the you know is we say isil isis you say you say isis in the in north america isis uh one of the methods of terror methods that they recommend you know on on online in their on their website i guess they have a website um, so he pretty much followed that recipe um yeah i know it's the same thing it's just that uh it's just um yeah that's what we know so far so it's 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 just horrible. It's horrible. Um, yeah, I uh, I'm waiting. For, I'm I'm going to have sausages. Yeah, I'll have sausages. Sausages, um, but I'm. Like I can't, I can't have sausages now because now I'm talking to you guys. Uh, Arvid is asking if I'm still making bows. Yes, I, I am. Yeah. Uh, I broke my sadly my U bow. I bo broke it, and now um, I, I want to make a proper heavy bow. You know. Uh, again so because the heaviest bow i have i think it's right now it's uh 40 something pounds um yeah so uh if you really want to s want me to s respond to no if you really want me to see your your comment because i can't see all the comments now uh give me a super chat it's uh <laughs> I'm not <laughs> shameful for saying that, but um, but don't you know? Don't do that if you 
if 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 you need the money yourself you know uh please um consider that as well but you know if you really want me to see your comment it will pop up if you give me a super chat so just so you know um but i'm trying to trying to keep an eye on on the um on the on the chat here uh if i expect negativity against bushcraft channels because of this um you never know with social media because they are crazy you know <laughs> um a citizen garden is here good to see you good to see you um yeah well we don't have all such all such orange here in in norway um uh, i know they are great it's quite expensive to buy one of those uh those bow staves uh and to get them to norway um sister tenacious uh, thank you for the donation thank you um uh please write your comments in english so that everyone can read them please but there's a question here uh, about supposedly history uh, uh, will be made voluntary in schools. I haven't heard about that actually, uh, but that that wouldn't be a good idea, you know, <laughs> not at all. Um, do we we have a troll here? Um, Uh, well, thank you for the donation there. Yeah, some words I can't say, but uh, yeah. Uh, dot, 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 and prepping. Um, and Harald, um, thank you for the donation. I don't know what, what shame I, I can't, I don't understand. I can't see the context right now. Um, what uh, what I'm using for bows here, I'm using um, uh, ash, maple, and um, my favorite is elm. Yeah. Okay, I'll have to uh, tend to the fire again. <clears throat> Okay. <coughs> oh. Now. <sighs> okay. Uh Dave, uh thank you for the donation. Oh yes, I am a big fan of Ray Mears. Oh, you met him. Uh, got his book signed. Been a fan of him. He says, yes, absolutely. Ray Mears is great. I, I've seen. I think all his uh, speaking of bushcraft and so on. Now I messed up my fire. Now why did I do that? That was silly of me. <sighs> Okay. Okay, we are good to go again. Um Yes, so I'm big fan of Ray Mears. Uh Sergeant Bear, thank you for the donation. Uh yes, the time difference. Uh there is a time difference, of course. Uh Thanks from Texas. Well, thanks to you for the donation and the comment. Um, yeah, well, I, I absolutely think that history and science are, I think they are crucial subjects for obvious reasons. 
Uh, now, Ray Mears, uh, what I like by Ray Mears is that he's obviously he knows what he's talking about. He's not so sensational, if you know what I mean, as the other guys, you know, because they are, in my mind, they are silly. And uh, these survival TV shows, what I've seen is, you know, it's always dangerous. So oh, they're. Uh, there are there are predators and there are so many dangerous things and uh, uh, yeah it's uh, it's silly it's really silly um, and they do crazy stuff that will will get you in trouble if you try that they eat things you shouldn't eat they uh, jump off cliffs and so on. Um, it's just very silly to do that. Uh, yeah, Ray Mears is laid back and calm, absolutely. Um, and <laughs> uh, there's this <laughs> Ray Mears now. You know, he's he's not he's he's got a little bit of a belly. You know, now he's older now, but you know, it's like uh, someone said or wrote somewhere. Uh, you should trust a fat bushcrafter <laughs> or a fat survivalist because they know what they're talking about. Okay. Um. What I'll um, what I'll try to do now is to I will try to turn the camera over. I'll try to make some food. Okay. Let's see how that goes. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll use my axe. It's a um, Hultsbruk. Uh, what's it called? Almike. To open the sausage uh, package <clears throat> I was actually going to be joined by someone here today uh but um he couldn't come because he had he got he had some knee problems <clears throat> so um yeah uh now let me see um native norwegian dinner uh <laughs> Native Norwegian dinner. Well, this is native Norwegian dinner. Sausages with um, lumpe. <laughs> um, do you watch Wrangler Star? Well, I, I maybe I was not so lucky with the videos. I, I, I saw a lot of talk about church and Jesus and, and all that. I'm not... You know that's not really my my main field of interest, so to speak. But um, uh, yeah, um, some questions here. I can't answer all the questions um, now. I'm going to have to try to find my spoon. 
while I talk. Okay, where is the spoon? Okay. Uh, I think I know. Uh, I think I know where it is. Ah. Uh. do like this instead you know okay can you um can you hear me can you still hear me i'll do like this again Uh, Dave, uh, thank you uh, for the donation. Uh, I will check out the channel. Absolutely. Uh, I did put my spoon somewhere very intelligent. Uh, it's just that I forgot where I put it. Um, I don't really need it. If you have an axe, you don't need a spoon. That's what I always say. Um, what I really want to have is my ketchup. Where is the ketchup? Uh, and I hurt my... Uh, I hurt my back. Uh, doing deadlifts. Um, a few days ago, I do that sometimes. Hold on, I'm going to have to put the light down somewhere like this and to sort out the food. I, I wasn't going to, wasn't going to, to make food while I was talking to you, but now I, you see I can multitask, you know. Ah. Oh. <sighs> oh. <sighs> okay. <sighs> Okay, so um, can't I can't find the um, sorry. I I can't find the the ketchup. Oh. Um. I will find it tomorrow morning. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, I uh, are we into the diet thing again here? Um, uh, 
Okay. Um, what are you going to be for Halloween? Well, I have this idea. You uh, and this is something that you can do as well. Uh, you have to. Do, you can't do it on your own. You have to work with someone, so to, so to speak. You have to do it with a friend or a family member. So you agree that you will pretend to be the other one. No, I'll, hold on. Yeah. So, for instance, if you're a couple, no, no, that gets complicated. Um, like um. I will I will say that I'm someone else and that someone else will say that he or she is me. So we don't have to spend money on on costume. You know, if you think you can save money. Um Gray Man Prepping has been a member for four months. Uh, thank you for that. My take on Grins Forsbrook's axes. Well, uh, I think they are the best axes. Um, well, Hurtsbrook, it's it is the same quality. But I am a big fan of uh, Grins Fors. Um, not cross dressing. It was a joke. You know, <laughs> it, it didn't. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, no. Um, yeah, the, the quality is great. It's, uh, but if you go to their website, I think you can still see that they have this. It says, We support Agenda 2030. I think it's they mean well, but you know, if you look at it on the surface, it looks nice, but it really isn't. <laughs> uh, okay. So I was a dis I was disappointed by them because of that. But the the axes are, you know, the excellent, excellent quality. Um, so, okay. Um, Did you look into a? F oh, sorry, sausages are ready. Um, oh, are we into the Jesus and and uh, Satan and all that debate again? I, I really, it's like <laughs> I I can't understand why. Why? I <laughs> I I don't really talk about it, you know, on my channel. Um, so yeah, but okay. <laughs> I have made mead. I have actually made me not. Um, not by my own honey. I don't keep bees, but um, yeah. Oh, the best uh, Mark Marvin, member for four months. Uh, thank you for that. The best tent to have. Well, it depends on where you're going, but if you're and the season and you know i would go as lightweight as possible while maintaining the qualities and safety that you should 
have in your tent. <clears throat> Okay. I lost the sausage. <clears throat> um. <clears throat> no, uh, yeah, sausage thief. That's me. That would be me. I have a video about that. I still feel a little bit bad about what I did that day, that was very naughty. I stole the sausage from, <laughs> yeah. You, 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 you will have to scroll down and find that video. Uh, it's, it's funny, it's a joke. Um, now the sausage I lost here, it rolled off the grill. And, um, yeah. Um, so I can't eat it. I'll I'll throw it out, and one of the trolls will come and eat it. You know. How do you live stream in the woods without the phone? I brought my laptop computer. <laughs> uh, and. A little thing that creates a Wi-Fi uh, signal. Um, thank you for the donation, MMM. Uh, <laughs> I really can't answer that, but I, I want to go in a more, you know, a con what can we do, you know? It is as it is now. What can we do to remain or, or go back to being more positive? Um, what can we do? The world has changed. And um, there is no, we, we don't get anywhere. But I'm not saying we should just accept it. Not at all. Not at all. I'll get back to this, but uh, I, you know, we have to move on, you know. Adam, good question. How to prepare if you don't have friends? Most of my life, I've not had friends and um, it is different try to learn many skills and try to be confident on your own and that will actually attract people to you. That's my experience, actually. It is lonely without friends. I know. I know what you're talking about. But... Um, there are people out there, good people, and um, I think you will be attracted. No, they will be attracted to positive people.
I'm eating, sorry. <clears throat> yeah. Steve B. <clears throat> um, comments that are disrespectful. I don't know if your comment was or if it contains words that you know are not nice i will delete them you know i will delete them um that doesn't mean that i'm i'm censoring it means that i want to i don't want you know it's if you can't behave uh and be respectful your comment will be deleted that's very simple you know it is very simple um and I, i've said it like I, i'll try to explain you know if you if you visit someone and you're in their home in their house you take your zipper down and you urinate on their floor do you think they will ask you to leave or will they ask you to stay? They will ask you to leave. So just think about that little, little it, you know, I don't know if what your, what kind of comment that was, but it's like, you have to be respectful. And if you're not you, your comment will likely be deleted. Um, sorry. <laughs> that was a burp. Um, um, <laughs> I'm not saying sorry for what I said, just because of that sound. I'm um, uh, out in the woods, so I think uh, some sounds are are okay. Um, <laughs> um, if you do have an X, uh, you don't need anything else. Yes. So. <clears throat> Um, I, <laughs> I, um, I'm going to, to end this live stream, uh, quite soon because, um, yeah, I'm, I'm being, I'm getting frustrated by the sound of the cars now. I don't know what's going on there. And it, it is some distance, actually. I'm not right by the road. Uh, yeah. Um, so... <clears throat> I'm going to. Uh, I, I've actually brought some something. Some I'm going to read a little bit before uh, it's uh, bedtime. Um, and um, I I will keep the fire burning a little little while. I can't keep it burning through the night, as I said before. That would not be possible uh, because of. It's not a big fire, uh, but also um, it wouldn't be safe. Um, <clears throat> so, um, I'm going to also film f some video clips for my video, uh, which I hope you will watch. It will probably be up tomorrow. Uh, it will be one video on this channel and one video on 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 Bjorn Outdoors, which you should subscribe to as well. The link is in the video description. Uh, I plan to do you know longer format videos on Bjorn Outdoors, so you might see a shorter version of the same video on this main channel from time to time. Okay. Uh, I'll have to tend to the fire and uh, thank you for uh, hi there Curtis 
good to see you. I I didn't see you earlier. The chat is moving so fast. Um, Grayman Prepping says, "Jeg trenger å lære norsk." Seems like you all already know Norwegian. Um, so yeah, okay. It's getting cold now, you know, outside, and uh, yeah. Have a nice evening or day or whatever it is, and we will uh, we'll talk later. And uh, check out the video. It will be up tomorrow. Okay. Bye.